30, a Broward County man is under arrest, accused of stealing a fire rescue ambulance. It happened outside a hospital in Deerfield Beach. CBS 4's Gary Nelson is live in Fort Lauderdale with more on this one. Gary. Uh, yeah, here at the county jail in Fort Lauderdale, just when you think you've heard it all, along comes Grand Theft Ambulance. Typically, when you need an ambulance, it's to get you to the hospital. But police say at Broward Health North Sunday afternoon, it was the other way around. You're charged with grand theft auto. But not just any auto. Michael Paul, police say, stole a Broward fire rescue ambulance like this one, just as firefighters were wheeling an emergency patient into Broward Health North, and Paul was being discharged as a patient. Satellite technology quickly located the purloined rescue vehicle. There was a GPS on the ambulance, and so deputies were quickly able to enable the GPS and track down the suspect who they took into custody within 30 minutes of the theft. The ambulance wasn't damaged, and nobody got hurt. Court documents say officers asked Paul, why did you do it? The suspect said that he just needed a car. The department says rescue workers routinely leave their engines running. They need the AC going, they need the emergency lights on. So at this situation, it's no fault of their own. Rescue 102 out of Deerfield was quickly put back in service. Thankfully, it wasn't needed for an emergency run while Paul was allegedly in it on the run. Paul is being held on $1,000 bond. The court documents show he is unemployed. Now, in addition to that grand theft ambulance charge, he is also charged with driving without a license. We're live in Fort Lauderdale. Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.